A given platform defines the normal alignment of fields within a struct. For example, on x86-64, we know that height should be 8 byte aligned relative to its struct, so this will be 8 bytes beginning uh, from the beginning of a step. But a compiler might give a programmer a way to control that alignment. Uh, GCC supports pragma pack with a number, and that number indicates the alignment for all fields in a struct independent of the type. So pragma pack 1 means that everything should be one byte aligned, including this double. Using pragma pack with no arguments restores the, the default handling of arguments so that height, if, it, if a similar type def happens after this pragma pack, height or, or any double field will be 8 byte aligned again. Put this example into a program over here where it allocates an array and performs some work over that array. My program starts by printing the size of step t. So with this pack uh, alignment of 1, uh, mode will take 1 byte and hit height will take 8 bytes, and so it should be 9 bytes total. And since alignment is optional as far as uh, the x86 processor is concerned, then this program should still work, and it'll take a certain amount of time. Uh, so we see 9 showing the size of step. That means that if I make an array of steps, uh, as I do in this program, that some of them will be 1 byte aligned, and 2 byte aligned, and 3 byte aligned, and so on, uh, relative to the absolute addresses. So an advantage of that, uh, of being able to choose that alignment, is that I can get a more compact structure. If I disable this uh, 1 byte alignment to always use the default, then we'll see that the size of that structure is 16. So I'm using more memory. Um, these time numbers are not at all useful since I'm running in a virtual machine on a, on a computer that's recording the screen. Um, but it may be that if you run this program on a typical, typical processor, it'll run a little bit faster even when it's using more memory. And that's because uh, double alignment for floating point numbers is a little bit faster at the processor level. There are all sorts of things that could affect the speed, but I've consistently seen the uh, normal alignment run faster in this case, and it's probably a, a result of making the processor happier. So there's a trade-off, uh, at least on x86, where both things, both aligned and non-aligned, worked. Uh, you can be more compact, or you can get a little bit more speed and a little bit more interoperability among programs that agree on uh, how fields are aligned in a structure.